you haven't seen this before, I have a five-star system. Uh, four and fives, those are good recommendations. They're awesome to really liked it. Three is I liked it. You might not like it, but I liked it. Two, if I give it two stars, I didn't like it. You might still like it, but I'm not recommended. One, even the author's mother didn't <laughs> like it. <laughs> so that's it. And what the Words on Words 60 Second Spotlight is, I'm going to talk to you about a book I've read in the last week. Um, I'm going to tell you the good stuff, the bad stuff. I'm going to give it a star rating, and I'm going to do it in 60 seconds or less. If I do it, I get fireworks. If I don't, which has happened three times in a row now, Loki blows me up. Yes, I do. So it's not happening tonight. I'm, All right. I'm well, we'll see. He it. said that last week. I but, did. <laughs> yeah. I did. All right. Well, cheers. <laughs> Are you ready, D? I'm ready. Three, two, one. This week's Words of Words 60 Second Spotlight is on uh, <laughs> by Julia <laughs> Douglas. <laughs> Speckled Venom Copperhead by Julia Douglas. Now, I, this is the Western. I didn't like it. Here's why. Uh, Lacey's 23 years old. She's 115 pounds, 5 foot 2. She's no brand of Tarth. But uh, we're supposed to believe that when she was 14, she was a successful bounty hunter. Didn't believe it. Secondly, she's got this love affair going on with Raleigh uh, Lovett. Uh, these guys are oil and water. They just don't mix. And I'm thinking, why didn't the author stretch this out as a multi-book series? But she didn't. She forced it down her throat, so I didn't like that. Second, or third, it's in the third-person omniscient point of view, which means that it's, we're in somebody's head all the time, uh, different people. So one paragraph from Raleigh's head, next paragraph, Lacey's, and Raleigh's and the person who brought him drinks. I'm thinking, why don't they make this more coherent, have a whole chapter inside Raleigh's head, a whole, a whole chapter inside Lacey's head, and who to hell with whoever brought him drinks. I don't care. So here's what I'm thinking. A speckle venom copperhead, Juliet Douglas, Two stars, and this has been a Words of Words Spotlight. We're a preview book for you, and we do it in 60 seconds or less. Help me. Come with, on. With five seconds left on the <laughs> Yeah. I, good job, Dean. I kicked that good into uh, into rap mode. Yeah, you did. <laughs> yeah, you and did. I even screwed you know, up You the screwed title. up in the beginning. You screwed up. And, yeah, all I could hear was... Blah, 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 blah. I couldn't... <laughs> and I went blank on the title, Speckled Venom Copperhead. It is a tongue twister. By uh, Julia Douglas. Um, this is the first in the series, and I thought this sounds pretty cool. From what it is, is won awards and everything, but I, I, uh, I will tell you this: the first pair, of first the chapter, I almost stopped reading it because there were so many grammatical mistakes in this thing. Oh wow! Yeah, and and I don't know why they would give somebody an award like that. And it, nothing is the author, but I think she needed a good editor. That's all. It's not a bad story. Yeah, I don't think it's her fault. There were, but there's a couple things I would have changed. I wouldn't have written it in, in uh, the point Rid of view. It? She, yeah, I would have writ, written it. In, uh, <laughs> you know, this is something that I constantly bring up to D, <laughs> and, and I'm gonna and I'm gonna I'm gonna pwn him a little bit right now <laughs> for being a guy. That sits at home and reads books a lot. Why do you do things like really, really, really not good? Or <laughs> he read it. <laughs> well, read it wasn't in a review, so you can bang me on that. Really, really, really not good was in, not in a review. Or it wasn't a review. So All right. what happens when you only got 60 seconds, It th your brain just starts to play with you. Oh, my and goodness. And, of course, I can see this guy out of the corner of my eyes <laughs> laughing all and right. doing all sorts of stuff. All right, guys, go and check out Freckled Venom Copperhead, Julia if Douglas, want. if you want, because D give, did give it a, a two, two star. star. So uh, we will have the link in the description. And uh, not bagging on, uh, on the, the author so much tonight as much as the editor. I don't think there was one. Well, that's, you know, now you're kind of bagging on <laughs> <laughs> well, no, what I'm saying is there's nowadays in books, I mean, there's half a million to a million books put out this is true. every year just in the United States because people can go self-publish all the time. And that's why I'm really big. There's a lot of good self-published out stuff out there. So that's not only true. in the uh, musicians but indie authors i've got some really good favors that i've come across that do a great job and sometimes people do need an editor i think if i published a book i'd want somebody to take a look at it first because i probably got some errors in there so I'm 